this butyl adhesive is so sticky, I can't get it off. So I have this little butane torch. Let's see if I can melt it off. So I've done all the scraping I can do, and I still have all this black butyl caulking all over. It absolutely has to be removed completely, or the adhesive for the new um, gasket won't stick. So I'm going to the hardware store to get something. So I have all this black butyl caulking to get off. I scraped as much as I can, but from here on out, it's going to take a chemical. Acetone on a rag is what was recommended. Let's see how it does. <clears throat> Tom Silva from this old house says you have to get all the all the butyl off. Because if you don't, the uh, gasket you're going to put on there with its own adhesive, it won't stick. Seems to be working pretty good. It's going to take me a little while to get it all off. I'll get back. Well, as you can see, the acetone did a fine job. Absolutely fine job. Of getting all that butyl rubber off. Looking good. With Alright, so the dry fit was successful. The plate is going to fit in there just nicely. All the holes line up with the holes on the plate. So now I have to attach this gasket right there. Peel off that tape and stick that on there. And uh, I this is the gasket that they gave me. It's all in place, all stuck in, all the way around. Now ready to place the window and bolt it in. So with this window, they gave me two sets of screws because I weren't sure which ones. Because when my friend went up to pick it up, it was, the owner wasn't there. It was just some uh, kid who worked there. So they gave me both. These ones aren't. This is the one I just tried. It's not long enough to go. <coughs> excuse me to go through the uh, panel and through the uh, the butte the um, gasket. So they gave me the longer ones. The problem is these longer ones are slightly thicker diameter than these. The little ones will fit through the holes that are already drilled in the plate. These do not fit through the holes. I have to get my uh, drill and drill out those holes with a pain in the neck. There it is, my friends. Thing of beauty. Getting these uh, bolts lined up with the holes was difficult. I actually had to drill out in a couple of spots to get them to line up. It's done. It's starting to rain. We'll see if it's working. Alright, so I just pulled all the Gorilla Tape off. I took the bolts off. Oop. It's time to do the big window. The big one. This is the big one. Elizabeth. <laughs> uh, I took the bolts off inside already and I pulled all that Gorilla Tape off that was up here. That was the only thing keeping the rain out. I don't want to have to break this window. I tried breaking the other window to get it out. Turns out I didn't need to. 
That was a treat. But we tried smacking that thing with that little emergency escape hammer there and it wouldn't break. So maybe I'll get lucky and I'll be able to pull this whole thing out in one piece. So I have all this silicone caught that I tried first. Or maybe it was that rubber stuff. I don't know, I forget. But I'm gonna slice into it just to see if I can break the bond. And I'd have to tug so hard to get this thing out. All right, so the window didn't want to come off voluntarily. I took off all the nuts that were holding it on from the inside. And I pushed from the inside, pushed real hard and banged on it. And it didn't want to come loose. So I tried smashing it again with, the, uh, with that emergency thing. I even just tried smashing it with a hammer. Didn't work, however. This might work. See that, all that silicone or rubber, whatever the heck it was. I can just pry this out with my pry bar, cut that with, the, with my razor knife, and I might still be able to pull this out in one piece without having to break it. Well, we got it out in one piece. <clears throat> Amazing. We didn't have to break it. We didn't have to shatter it. I used a pry bar. And I just cut away all this silicone that was holding it in place. And I would just pry it apart and cut that stuff and pry it and cut it. And finally, we got it to come off in one piece. Yeah, it looks a little weird in here now, doesn't it, with the big window missing.